kind of with that at its core, that's what we can learn through, I guess, and, and, and why we try to do justice to the, the broader picture. Um, that was that was the thing that was most important at this point. But in addition, you also had an art director, um, and you had other artists that were um, uh, from from a, a oh. similar type of region and uh, cultural sensitivity. Uh, yeah, we too. Our director uh, Reza Ria, he is, is is Persian. He's from Tehran, but um, yeah. So, uh, but, but we we look very much at Afghan um, uh, miniatures, uh, Afghan and Persian miniatures. We looked at a lot of artwork from the region. We looked at artifacts. Uh, Afghanistan has such a rich history and, and culture, and there are so many um, you know, amazing countries. In Afghanistan. I think what we were also I was aware of it was that that particular regime tried to separate the people from their history. You know, when you look at those, you know, very famous images of the Bamiyan uh, Buddhas being blown up. Um, so again, I, I think especially with the story world, we tried to make sure that we marked a lot of the, the colors that you associate with Afghanistan, a lot of the visual motifs in terms of the, the artwork and that just goes that, um, so that they're there and that they're the, we, we, we got a sense that Nurulan um, was passing that on to Pravana, that it was her heritage, you know. Did you have a chance to see the, um, the production uh, design and the artwork behind the film? It's really extraordinary. And Kieran Duffy, who is an Irish um, art director, and Reza Riahi, uh, and Dabi, what's Dabi's last name? Ithan. Uh, Ithan? Ithan. Uh, who's from Iraq. Uh, the artwork is absolutely superb. Um, I mean, you can see it, in, obviously, on the screen, but just to see their concept work is just, it's just absolutely breathtaking. Uh, so I hope that uh, you can uh, you know, find, yeah. it on, find a blog. You can see some of oh, it. <laughs> you can see some of it at uh, thebreadwinner.com. We actually have an interactive study guide for students there, and um, it goes into quite a lot of detail about the animation process, um, Afghanistan, and kind of the language arts aspects of the book and the movie. But there are a couple of videos there that take you behind the scenes as well, so you can skip through that the things that ask you to try and find the symbolism in the movie and things like that, and uh, go through the videos and you might catch them right there. And while you're there, there's also a theatrical update. So, um, you know, because November 17th, which I believe is Friday, the film comes out, um, and uh, so it, it opens here uh, at the New Art, and then it also opens in New York, and um, so we, we really need it with all independent films. Uh, you know that opening weekend is so important uh, for the rollout. I want my family in Rilo, Michigan, <laughs> to be able to see the film. So you know, um, share, you know, show your love with the ticket, and um, you know, please help my brother and my niece and my nephew. <laughs> um, but uh, but anyway, so yeah, so go to thebreadwinner.com. Um, it will be constant.